Hi everyone, Jim Becker here. Today, we're diving into the age-old debate, would you rather have experience or enthusiasm in business? So as business professionals, CEOs, leaders, entrepreneurs, and salespeople, this is a crucial question. Both experience and enthusiasm play significant roles in our careers, but how do we balance them? And which one ultimately has a bigger impact? Stick around because we're going to break it all down right here. Let's start with experience. As we get older, we accumulate a wealth of knowledge and skills. We've been through countless situations, learned from our successes and mistakes, and honed in our own personal craft. Think of a seasoned chef who knows exactly how to balance flavors to perfection. See, experience brings depth, reliability, and a refined approach to work, our work. With experience comes a sense of confidence. We know what works and we know what doesn't work. We've seen all patterns repeat, and we've developed strategies to handle various challenges. This depth of knowledge allows us to navigate complex situations with ease, and mentor others effectively. When you have years of experience, you can anticipate problems before they arise and steer your team clear of potential pitfalls. But here's the catch. Sometimes with experience comes complacency. We might lose a bit of that initial spark, that eagerness to explore and innovate. Our learning curve flattens as we encounter fewer big, exciting challenges and more incremental improvements. We might start relying too much on what we know and become resistant to new ideas or changes. When you have experience, you also have the ability to make more nuanced decisions. Experience gives you the wisdom to understand the subtleties of different situations. It helps you read between the lines and pick up on new things that might not be immediately obvious to yourself. See, this ability to see the bigger picture and understand the underlying factors can be incredibly valuable in business. Here's one example. In negotiations, an experienced negotiator knows how to read the room, understand the motivations of everyone around, especially of those other parties. And they find common ground between them and you. They know when to push and when to pull back. They can anticipate the objections and have strategies ready to address them before they're even thought of. This kind of skill comes with years of practice and exposure to these various situations that we see over a lifetime. See, this experience also helps in building relationships. Over time, you learn how to connect with different types of people, how to build trust, and how to manage conflicts. These interpersonal skills are crucial in business where relationships can make or break deals. An experienced leader knows how to motivate their team how to handle difficult conversations, and how to inspire loyalty. Now, let's talk about enthusiasm. Enthusiasm is like a burst of energy. It's contagious. It drives innovation, and it fuels growth. Think of a startup founder who's passionate about their idea, working day in and day out to bring it to life. Enthusiasm brings fresh perspectives, creativity, and a relentless drive towards success. Enthusiasm can push us to take risks and try new things. It's a feeling of excitement that makes us want to jump out of bed in the morning and tackle the day's challenges that lies before us. Enthusiasm can inspire those around us as well, creating a positive and energetic work environment. When you're enthusiastic, you're more likely to think outside of the box, come up with innovative solutions. However, enthusiasm without experience can sometimes lead to a mistake, definitely to several 
mistakes or missed opportunities. Enthusiastic individuals might rush into decisions without fully understanding the complexities involved. It's like trying to bake a cake with lots of excitement but no recipe. You might end up with something tasty, maybe, but it could easily go wrong too. Enthusiasm can sometimes make us overlook details or underestimate the risks. Enthusiasm is partly valuable in times of change or when embarking on a new project, it brings a sense of urgency and motivation that can help drive projects forward. It can help overcome inertia and resistance to change. See, when people are enthusiastic about what they're doing, they're more likely to put in the extra effort needed to achieve great results. Enthusiasm also has a way of attracting opportunities. When you're passionate and excited about your work, it shows people are drawn to that energy. They want to be part of it. This can open doors and create opportunities that might not have otherwise encountered. Enthusiasm can help you build a network of supporters and advocates who can help you achieve your goals. But as mentioned earlier, enthusiasm alone is not enough. No. Without experience, you might find yourself making the same mistakes over and over again. You might miss important details or fail to really anticipate potential problems. This is why it's important to balance enthusiasm with experience. So how do we balance experience and enthusiasm? Ideally, we want both. Here are some strategies to help maintain your enthusiasm while leveraging your experience. First, stay curious. Never stop learning. This is where I always say, act like you've never learned this before and learn it newly. See, if you go to the past way, like I already know this, you're already out. Be curious about it. Forget that you learn it. Forget how to do it. Learn it brand new, the way that they're teaching you, as if it was never there. This is how you stay curious. Never stop this learning. Approach everything this way. Approach challenges with the curiosity of a beginner's mind. Seek out new experiences, even in familiar fields. Read widely, attend workshops, and always, always be on the lookout for new ideas and trends. See, curiosity keeps your mind active and engaged, preventing complexities and complacency. Second, embrace change. Be open to new ideas and technologies. Don't let experience make you resist to change. When you're resistant to change, things stop. Instead, use it as a foundation to explore new horizons. Change can be intimidating, yes, it can, especially when you're comfortable with your current knowledge and skills. But remember, change is also an opportunity for growth. And innovation. Third, engage with younger, enthusiastic individuals. Their energy can reignite your own passion and you can provide them with valuable guidance. See, mentorship is a two-way street. While you're sharing your knowledge and experience, you're also learning from their fresh perspectives and enthusiasm. See, this exchange of ideas can be incredibly enriching. Fourth, set new goals. Keep setting ambitious goals that challenge you. This will keep your enthusiasm alive and ensure you're always striving for more. Don't be afraid to step out of your own comfort zone and tackle something new and exciting. Setting and achieving new goals keeps your professional life dynamic and fulfilling. Lastly, reflect on your achievements and celebrate your progress. Sometimes we get caught up in the daily grind that we forget to acknowledge how far we've come so far. 
taking time to really reflect on your achievements can rekindle your enthusiasm and remind you of why you're passionate about your work. Experience and enthusiasm play two different roles in your career. They're two different stages completely. Early in your career, you might rely more on enthusiasm to drive your growth and learning. As you gain more experience, you can start leveraging your knowledge and skills to achieve greater success. However, it's important to continue nurturing your enthusiasm and seeking out new challenges. Even as you become more experienced in leadership roles, experience often is crucial because it allows you to make strategic decisions, not to mention mentor others, manage complex situations. However, enthusiasm is also important because it can inspire and motivate your team, drive innovation, and help you stay engaged and passionate about your work. See, in roles that require a lot of creativity and innovation, such as entrepreneurship or sales, enthusiasm might play a bigger role. Enthusiasm can help you generate new ideas, take risks, and connect with customers and your clients. However, that experience is still important because it can help you avoid common pitfalls, make informed decisions, and build lasting relationships. In conclusion, both experience and enthusiasm are vital for success in business. Experience brings depth and reliability, while enthusiasm drives innovation and growth. The key is to balance both leveraging your experience to make informed decisions while keeping enthusiasm alive to push over those boundaries and explore new opportunities. Now I want to hear from you. Which do you think is more important in your role, experience or enthusiasm? Share your thoughts in the comments below. Let's start our a conversation talking about experience and enthusiasm and bring them together. Remember, to like, subscribe, and check out my profile for more content to help you elevate your business game. Together, we can all work towards elevating humanity, one post and one step at a time. Keep making a difference out there. Love you.